So guys, the players are in front of me now, putting the tiles away. So um, when when they're ready, and when since we're ready, you know we're gonna pretty much start immediately. So uh, excellent. So it is James's start, I believe. Okay, whose rack is on the left? Um, it will be Austin's rack on the left, and James's Austin. on the right. Okay. It's, it's it's just a case of where they're sitting. Right. James's okay. rack will be on the right. No, we don't need to swap them around. We, it, it's just visuals. We don't need to swap racks around. It's just a case of going the the way of you know, right to left instead of left to right. But um. But yeah, when we're ready. You know, we'll get these players starting. Oh, look at this headless person right here. And look, Austin has basically never stopped. But anyway, they're drawing. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I'll see you guys on the other end. Okay. So we've got uh, James Burley to start. And uh, Gutam, are, uh, are, you, are you with us? <clears throat> Austin's got the uh, first blank there uh, on the left. He's got two W's as well. So that could be a little problematical at first. And on the other side, a pretty nice uh, pretty nice opening rack with two S's, a couple of vowels for, um, for James. So um, <clears throat> we're going to see uh, James, James playing first. He's lining up Fash, which... Uh, Seems to make uh, seems to make sense. He keeps O R S. Was he's got frosh, which would have been, uh, which would have been a, a a stronger play, a much a much higher score would have been uh, would have been frosh. So, uh, bash is not a disastrous uh, mistake, but uh, we can see on the uh, screen there he also had a bingo, which uh, I certainly didn't know. Show fast. So uh, there we there we go. In both our first opening games, we've seen bing bingos miss for the players. <clears throat> so what just happened? See, Austin there has uh, seen uh, yeah. Whitlow, yeah. which is his only bingo, believe, or I believe, but uh, yes. it it uh, it'll take um, it'll take an S, and uh, that's going to be uh, be uh, Austin's play. I'm not expecting him uh, not expecting him to miss that. He's just uh, thinking, have I got anything else? Are, the, are you with us there, uh, Gutan? Yeah, I, I, just, I just came back. Okay, okay. Oh, oops. Oh, oh, so he's, he has missed Whitlow's. Well, oh, wasn't okay. sure, I guess. He must have not been sure. I mean, it's it's yeah. uh, it's interesting that in the, both the first two turns, we've got players missing bingos. Um, although, uh, you know, as we as we saw in the first game, it's, uh, you know, it's part and parcel of the game. So, uh, 
Yeah, it's, it's nothing. It's nothing really special. I mean, it just happens all the time. Exactly. Did you know shofars? I, I, I didn't. Uh, no what? I thought he should have played Frosh, which uh, which I did know, but um, uh, I didn't. I didn't know shofars. So here we've got uh, things he, like. He actually had a thing on his bus, right? Yeah, he did. Shofars, oh. apparently. Mm, so uh, it was uh, it, it was an interesting uh, interesting play that uh, oh. he missed. Here we've seen Walf, which is a lovely uh, lovely dumper of uh, of uh, clunky consonants along with many, many similar words. And it's obviously opened up the possibility here to play something simple like Goy. Yeah. And he's going to do that straight away. And uh, we hardly blame him for that. He doesn't like two R's on the rack, which uh, which obviously de detracts. But it may not be the end of the world if he can get a, a vowel or two. If he draws an E, it should be fine. He just, he just kind of draw another R. Yeah, if he draws another eye, he can uh, he can kiss goodbye to uh, the rat. Possibly, he might have to change, but a uh, we'll we'll see what happens here. So uh, Austin has got the J on his rack, and we'll be hoping to uh, score score with that and balance so that he can uh, perhaps bingo on the next turn. No, he's he's the best player probably. Been be playing Jilt and TWO, which doesn't leave the best yeah. leaf. Yeah. So he may, he may not be yeah. able to draw and go straight away. Uh-huh. Yeah, Jilt, Jilt, uh, a bit of, uh, bit of, bit of light shining on the uh, rack there. What's, what's the other letter that, uh, that, that is next to the blank there? Do you know uh, what that I, is? I. It's an I. So he would leave I, O, blank, which of course yeah. is not, is not, not a problem. It could go wrong. Um, but he doesn't want to have two eyes if he can help it. So uh, jilt, jilt certainly looks like a, looks like a, a possible play. He he could just go for something like A G A J I uh, and uh, and be done with it and uh, and almost ensure that you have a bingo on the next turn. But uh, he's obviously giving away a lot of points if he does that. So jilt, uh, jilt, uh -huh. jilt's jilt's going to score. Yeah, jilt is still better. Yeah. Yeah, Jill's still best. You can, you can still draw it, a bingo it, score, I think. Yeah, 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 for sure. But he, I, I, I think he's thinking about it. Do you think, Jill? No, he's he, he's he's lining it up. I don't, I don't, I don't think he's going to forego the points just to uh, yeah, pretty I, much I, I ensure think, a bingo. I don't think AG is going to be that, that that useful. No. Just throwing it out there as a possibility. I mean, it, it does guarantee a bingo. Yeah, that's true. I O blank could go wrong, um, but Jill scores, and it looks like looks like he's going to make that uh, make them make his mind up there. He's uh, he's taken a few minutes uh, of his time there to make sure he's uh, happy to do, he's doing the right thing. So Jill goes down, and uh, that's, that's that's for he, seems have, he seems he seems to have blocked the X and drawn the X, which is what we always do. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's for sure. Yeah, that doesn't. Does he have a bingo? B B I A D I O blank. Okay, so. Uh to try and perhaps get one of those R's off his rack. Um, but what would you say to just dumping XI on this turn? Is uh, does that have any merit? Sure, that, that works. I think I think it works, doesn't it? Because, or, or, AX, uh, or AXXI also works, I guess. A uh, the the A the A of Fash, I guess. Hmm. I think with this rack, I kind of, uh, I kind of think uh, that uh, he's going to surely uh, have a good chance to bingo on the next turn with uh, with that rack if he just plays the X. But uh, we'll see what he does. Um, obviously, uh, Roji at the top is also a possibility in keeping the X. That's, that's, actually, Roji is quite uh, Roji is quite strong because you can just play the X next turn to yeah. score. 
it, it guarantees that he can play OX on the next on the next turn. It's unlikely to be to be taken, and he'd have the he'd have the play along along the top if that was taken anyway. Um, so it it might be good, but I still I don't know. My own feeling is, uh, do we know what Quackles is suggesting on this turn? Uh, let's just let's, let's, uh, just look at the the quick choices first, I guess. I just want to jump in really far. Yeah. Okay. Oh, he's he's trying he, he's trying he's trying to throw away one of the R's here, yeah. okay. which is fine. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, opened things up uh, a great deal there, and. Uh, are we looking yeah, at two eyes as well there on the Iraq? Mm, yeah, it's not bad. But playing so many letters, uh, you know, it, 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 it could turn out to be um, to mess up a bingo opportunity, but we'll see. He's uh, I mean, he's played that uh, he's, with he's IRS. Too wrong, so. It can, it can. No problem. Yeah. So it's like, it's like honestly, uh, uh, R R O E S is the same as the I R S for the most part. Yeah. Oh, if she, uh, she, uh, Jessica is saying that uh, Austin has a bingo. If she can play. Uh -huh. Okay, good. So Austin has a choice between uh, A and O B I I D, which is playing, or uh, O R I B A T I D. Okay, or abated. So this is uh, this is a very nice uh, and rather strange word. Any idea what it means, uh, Victor? An obeyed. The sort of play that uh, the top Scrabble players uh, will uh, will will see in a heartbeat. So uh, it's. Uh, Wow, that's a, got, that's a fantastic pickup. Yeah, it's got uh, James has got, got many many bingos to uh, to Oxa, so um, he's just going to choose uh, choose the best one. And Austin has failed to lock set. It seems. Drawing yeah, I, definitely very clunky there. So we, again, we're going to see uh, a game here where it's going to be very close after uh, after the first three three moves, and uh, then we're going to then we're going to see probably um, uh, Austin needing to score reasonably low to uh, to balance. Um, so it's all to play for at the moment. So uh, James can probably choose to play Oxus or choose to play Anno Bits. Uh, uh, either one will work. Yeah. Would he have a play right the way underneath uh, Anobid, making uh, H O I S, possibly? Would he? Would he? Would he have anything there? I would think so. Yeah. It looks like it, doesn't it? I don't think he has enough vowels to do it now. He can't. Yeah. So uh, James just uh, biding his time here and uh, thinking through the possibilities. This was, uh, obviously. Plenty of time left for both players, so he's going to uh, going to go through the processes of thinking uh, what what strategically might be the best thing to do. He's uh, he's got no 
problems about uh, what he might uh, about the bingos he's got. He's got uh, I don't know. There will be dozens and dozens of possibilities on there down to uh, oxes. So uh, he has to he has to carefully think which uh, which words right play to impress the audience the most. <laughs> impress that's, the that's audience. Give the yeah, that's right. Give the least. Uh, give the least away. He's obviously mindful. He's is uh, is is on television around the world, and uh, people are peeping look, looking at his plays. It will be a an experience that will be rather unusual for James. Um, Austin maybe, will be more. Maybe he's familiar. trying to find a ten-letter word uh, starting with T W O. Yeah, or, or going through H O I possibly, you know, who 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 knows? Uh, hoi polloi, um, something uh, something similar. He, he presumably he'd even have a bingo, wouldn't he? Down to the E D, which would be a nine-letter word. So uh, uh, that, that know, would be a lot. Uh, I think that would be quite simple, but it doesn't score anything. So uh, no, you, you get, no. you'll get style points, which which don't really help. No, no, it, 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 it style style points for a nine letter word, but uh, it, it doesn't make any sense to do that. Um, can he put the P on the double and the S on oxes? Uh, like, I don't think so. He can't like re, re clips. That's no good, right? No, no. He, he basically has to choose between something like yeah, spoiler or replies or repliers, hooking anno bits. Heard our next round game will be Graham Haig against Ellie Dangor, so that will be coming up uh, coming up after this. It seems the cracker is not showing the repliers option. Mm. This time, certainly, huh? we'll see. Um, we're seeing uh, Austin sitting on a rack that he hasn't got anything uh, to figure the right out until until, um, until James plays. I mean, he's uh, you know he can throw a lot of tiles away with Trented or something like that. Um, but he's he's really stuck here with waiting to see what uh, what um, what happens from uh, from from James before he can really uh, really go through his options. So we're uh, we're obviously waiting here until we see uh, see what James does. Uh, actually, the the enemy does actually take an S. I don't know why Crackle says it doesn't. Enemy does take an S. You're saying, yeah. yeah. It's a mystery. Oh, oh he's, he's going for a star he's, point. He's, he's, oh my God, I, I can't <laughs> believe it. Slippered, presumably. Well, I mean, uh, why would you, why would you, is more important uh, sometimes. Maybe, maybe. I mean, you know, uh, <laughs> it, it, it doesn't make a great deal of sense unless he's not 100% sure that Oxa takes an S. I, it's a possibility, I suppose, but, uh, um, okay, he, he he's 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 given away very very little with that, but not uh, not actually maximise his score. So, uh, however, it's, it's it it's not the end of the world, and we've seen a nine letter word, <laughs> albeit uh, a fairly uh, a fairly straightforward one. Oh, uh, he, uh, the play is being hold, and he's he's going he's going to challenge it, so he's he's going to get his star points worth. It seems. He's going to get an extra five. The, yeah, the five points is his star points. Though. Would slipper be a, a verb or an adverb? Uh, I'm, I'm, uh, is, is that the right the right word? I'm afraid I'm not a language teacher anymore. I've forgotten all these things. But uh, um, slipper makes yeah, sense yeah. to me. It looks like he just played it to get the five points from Austin to to to, to, you know, <laughs> to, to, have, to, have, to oh, have a moral victory. I, yeah, yeah, in your in your in your face, Arsenal boy. He <laughs> says, uh, "I've uh, I've got I've got five I've got five points off you." You know, I'm enjoying myself. I mean, Scrabble's about more than just playing the right move, equity, and all these all, all these wonderful words that the Scrabble players come up with. Um, They're it's, off uh, it's, a, it's about having fun. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> So uh, he's going to be pleased with that. Gets an extra five, and that makes him ten points ahead after uh, after four moves and three for Austin. 
Wow. He needs a, he needs a floating E right now. He does. Behavior will be uh, will be wonderful. Um, Unfortunately, Austin's rank is not very horrible, it. so he cannot provide an E. He's not going to provide an E. Uh, he's going to dump some consonants through one of the vowels, possibly the uh, the I. Um, so we're going to, or the A is a possibility as well. Uh, yeah. So we're going to uh, let's see. Can he do anything to get rid of two Ts? I mean, you you could try to fish by playing A T T, but that doesn't seem like. Well, I mean, you, you don't really have a lot of options, I guess. Yeah, it, it could easily it could easily turn uh, turn nasty, couldn't it? I uh, if if you want to score, you could just play T A J and hope that you draw vowels. It may not be a bad idea. Yeah. If you if you if you draw like an A and an E, you can just play like red right next turn. Oh, in fact, if you draw if you play touch and you draw A E, you just have a big goal. So. Yeah. He's going to spend a little bit of time thinking here about. Uh, it, it depends how he feels at the moment, really. Uh, the board is uh, it's not uh, wonderfully open at the minute. Um, Slippered because of the fact he doesn't. Neither player has an S. Uh, Slippered has kind of uh, made it all all, all all a bit tight. Um, so uh, yeah, it's uh, it's lots of uh, lots of lots of choices here. It depends how he feels more than uh, what more, more than anything as to uh, what what he's going to do. He plays Dit, and yeah, fine, yeah. Dit is a key move, really. I think here because uh, Dit dumps two of those, two of those three Ts, and um, you know it leaves him with the 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 four letters of the the, uh, the bingo stem retina, and uh, and look what he's drawn. <laughs> Uh, it's, uh, I think it's, it's fine for now, it's fine for now. So we've got hijabs come down, which uh, yeah, is great. a lot. It's a great score, gets a very, 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 very big score. And uh, that is going to be uh, a good lead at this point for James. Uh, if if the if the dictionary is wrong, it's okay. It's for for now, you can just leave it as it is. It's fine. So we've got one one seven here, which uh, doesn't go down. Um, and uh, I'm sure have we have we got an eight there, uh, Guta? No, can't see yeah, anything. Yeah, yeah, he doesn't have anything. Yeah, the H hasn't given him anything. So uh, again, we're going to see here probably a cagey little play, perhaps giving himself uh, an opening for a bingo on the next turn. He's obviously got to get rid of one of the one of the ends. Um, could see him doing something very, very, uh, very short here. He doesn't want to break up this rack to any great degree, but he wants to give himself an opening to play. Yeah. So, and he, has, uh, he has me opening because he's kind of in danger right now. Yeah, yeah, he is. Meanwhile, uh, James's rack on the right is uh, is not in a great shape, um, but he uh, he will be able to uh, to score something at the top. Uh, he's got yeah, he's room, of course, room, but I'm not sure he's going to be able to. Um, uh, room doesn't. Oh uh, no, he he can just be a room and ditto. Should be alright. Yeah, room together. and ditto. Yeah, room and ditto will will be a nice scoring move on the next on the next turn. Um, so uh, again. Um, as uh, Austin lines up anger, he's probably feeling a bit cross <laughs> here. But he uh, he hasn't actually uh, got a place for Regnant, and um, 
again, he's, you know, he, here is where Scrabble is very interesting. It often comes down to very short little plays, you know, you know, do I, do I place some easy three letter words? But it, it's just as important in Scrabble that uh, you pick that you pick the right one that's going to give you the best opportunity uh, uh, coming up. What about Agon, A-G-O-N? Is that too open or what, what do you think? A-G-O-N. I think he's trying to play a uh, Rango over there. Oh, sorry, Ranger. So he's going to score. Yeah, that, that, yeah. that's, that's going to be yeah. fine. It, may, it makes sense. I, I, you know, it, it depends how you're feeling, but I don't know if I, I quite like Agon, although it could have gone wrong. I mean, we, we have the benefit of seeing that James hasn't got an E. Um, I think if he knew that, he might have played Agon. But anyway, Ranger scores, obviously, yeah. and uh, turns over tiles. And here we go. We have a look there. And now he's got too many vowels. So, uh, <laughs> bless. I mean, this is Scrabble all over. You go from one extreme to the other. We think that uh, Vroom is going to be the uh, is going to be the best play here. Can you see anything else uh, that's been created, Gutam, from Ranger? Vroomed, obviously. Um, uh, room, room is in there. But it doesn't it's score room, anything actually. like as much as Vroom. He maybe tempted to just play VOM score and try to draw a bingo. Mm. Or he, or maybe he might try to play uh, dorm, keeping V O R, which is also reasonable. So he's got some scoring possibilities. V O M at the top would uh, would would score very well. Vroom scores reasonably well. Um, Vroomed blocks everything up. Um, you know, uh, it's it doesn't score very well. Um, I think I might just play Dom keeping V O R because you have the you have the floating E available. Dom so, or at the top over over hijab. Now he's going to play bomb. Door may well have been better. It, 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 this could go wrong, um, but he scores. So there we go. And he, he's got the, the O for Oho and, uh, and, a, and a score there, possibly like uh, uh, Rorid goes at the bottom there oh, yeah, um, yeah, that's true. on the next turn. So it, it, he, he's probably thinking, you know, that, that looks cute for my next play if things go pear shaped, uh, 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 you know. Uh, so, so, but um, I'm not sure if I would. Have played Vom over over Vroom. I think I think I'd rather play Vroom there. But there you go. He's uh, he's uh, drawn something that looks like corduroy. <laughs> oh, that's a fairly reasonable draw, I guess. He can yes, score he, he he can score with it for sure. Um, meanwhile, uh, Austin uh, Austin on the left there has uh, hasn't got any anything. Um, so he's gonna. He's going to play um, some, uh, a score. He's going to play a lot of letters there. He plays uh, Leon there, yeah, uh, and that will uh, that will score, and uh, we'll leave him te balances rack, places to play on the next turn. He's hoping to draw a bingo and yes, uh, no, no, take the lead. He has more openings. He's need he needs to keep the game open. He's uh, he, he's a little bit behind. Um, Ooh, sack. Oh, but I don't, oh, I don't, I don't oh, think please, though. No. Oh, what did he? That is unfortunate if there's no place to play. Um, yeah, that's pretty, that's pretty unfortunate, Luxac. Yeah, an unfortunate Luxac. Luxac being one of Gutem's favourite words, me, uh, which isn't a word for anybody uh, who's wondering or, or scrambling to find out, uh, find uh, find it in any dictionary but uh, it's used by a lot of people uh, in his part of the world in Singapore am I correct in saying that yeah that's correct we uh, we, we don't use it much in Thailand because we then tend to talk about the the, uh, the game of Scrabble uh, we don't even use the word Scrabble we talk about uh, Scrabble being called crossword game and we don't use English <laughs> to talk about it we only use Thai so a word like Luxac doesn't doesn't come into the matter there's a uh, the Thai words for lucky and the uh, and we'll be done with it. Uh, but uh, 
That's Thailand. So what, what, what do you think uh, might be a sensible, uh, sensible play here? He can't, he can't play Rorid now because that would leave C-U-Y and that could be awful. The, the Y hooks onto, uh, onto Ditty. Yeah, the and he can play, s- he can play something like Ditty and Corey uh, would, would make sense. There's no point in doing any blocking here. He's, he's got to think about... Uh, about um, he could play Scurry. What do you think of Scurry? Uh, I think it's fine because Austin can't really score unless he has the perfect rack. So Scurry should be fine to me. Scurry would leave uh, D O, and uh, that would be uh, that would be kind of cute. It uh, yeah, Scurry is good for just right drawing off in the back. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's right. Uh, oh, actually, okay. he, he might. Sure might want to play Dory on top of him. That. Dory on where? Uh, above, above hijab. Oh yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah, that, that works too. Your score as well, obviously, leaves him with a potential to for things to go go badly with uh, no no vowels and drawing uh, drawing to three consonants can often go wrong, um, but we'll see. There's only one vowel open. At the moment, and uh, but CDR is uh, is very bingo conducive should the right tiles come up. So we'll we'll see here uh, what uh, what what James can draw. He's got a nice K to go with the C, and he's got a lovely S. But as we can see, famous last words, he's stuffed. Although he'll be able to score through uh, through the E, uh, but will he get a chance to uh, to actually use it? We we shall see. Uh, this could be uh, this could be interesting. So what, what do you do? You think uh, do you think um, Austin should break up his rack by playing Audity to the any to the E anyway, and and and, and going to the bag, or, or or what do you think he should do here? Play uh, play two vowels off. What do you think? Uh, he's actually in a pretty bad situation now, if you ask me. Yeah, he, 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 I think he's well behind. He may have to fish now, I think. <laughs> Don't yeah, you yeah, yeah, yeah. Your, your best fish should be L E U, I think. Yeah, yeah. He's he, he's starting to get into a situation where he uh, he's going to need a bingo on the next turn to catch up. So um, uh, he he can't really uh, he can't really. Um, uh, just make a score and uh, keep things running along because uh, he, he doesn't know that uh, he doesn't know that uh, James is sitting on a, a big problem here. But um, okay, he plays three vowels and scores. So the problem is that is that it it kind of it kind of it constrains the e and it doesn't open up a new line. So I would prefer to play uh, l i e u through the other l or l e u instead. Mm. Well, he's gone for a little bit more score than L I E U from the uh, the L of Leone. So um, now we're looking at a situation where surely he's just going to make a score through uh, through um, through the E. Are we not? Yeah, probably just throw throw the K on the triple. Yeah, um, he's obviously uh, you know he 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 hasn't got. Uh, he hasn't got anything I can see that sh- which solves his problem under the oh. M I at the top, has he? Yeah, yeah. M I C C I D. That's that's his best play. Say it again. Uh, M I C C I D will work. That's fine. So. Uh, on the left there, uh, Austin has drawn two A's. Meanwhile, which is uh, which is not going to be wonderful for him. So CID scores keeps a keeps a very very uh, pleasant CKNRS, which with two vowels is going to be absolutely wonderful. But but he's got to draw them, and with uh, with Austin sitting on several vowels, uh, sometimes these situations turn to players. One player has loads of vowels, one player doesn't have any, and uh, <laughs> yeah. that's scrabble. So we'll see what he what he picks up. Ooh, ooh, uh, ooh, ooh, he, oh, and he, 
and he has. So this game now with uh, the obvious snicker is uh, is uh, is going to be uh, is going to be very likely to be in the hands of James Burley, who uh, is going to surprise uh, surprise Austin here. Um, uh, I think I think Austin is basically lost at this stage. It looks like it. Uh, he's not going to. He's not going to block. Uh, he's not going to block uh, James on this turn. So um, this is now looking uh, like uh, what we'd have to say is an upset uh, with uh, Austin Austin Shin, who currently is holding all before him in uh, in tournaments uh, around the world. He's he's set up A A L, which obviously takes uh, several letters like uh, B and P and T on the front. Um, and will be a scoring place later on. But he's going to find himself uh, 160, 170 behind, uh, or 150 at least, yeah. behind after this move. So it's not going to be good. And he has to draw the, he has, he has, to, he has to first draw the front hook to the AL, so. Jeez. Yeah, exactly. So uh, we're going to see uh, a bingo for sure from uh, James, whose heart. His heart must be beating very, very fast because he's thinking, hey, I'm going to win my, you know, I'm going to win uh, a game against Austin Shin. Yippee! He's going, to be as happy. <laughs> he's going to be as happy as Larry. If I was sitting on that, I'd be thinking, my God, this is unbelievable. Austin there with his uh, shirt on, which has become quite famous in Scrabble, which scoring never stops. But uh, it looks like the scoring has pretty much dried up for Austin in this uh, <laughs> game. So this game so far, so. Looks like the T-shirt's not quite working at this stage, but of course, uh, it's uh, oh. there's many there's many games to go. His, his opponent is, his op his opponent's scoring is not stopping, so technically, he's got a bingo himself. Uh, so he's uh, he's going to go for the score, which is going to leave uh, tenanted for uh, for Austin. So he's going to have a small chance of coming back. Um, in, in yeah. this game, but, uh, but it's only going to be a small chance. It would have been even safer, perhaps even safer, if he'd played a slightly less scoring play uh, on uh, putting BES, but then it would have opened up best anyway. So uh, who's yeah. to blame? Uh, who, who's to blame um, James for playing Snicker like that? He scores more. Um, I mean, that's, 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 the correct, that's, that's the correct play, because uh, if you play BES, it takes, a, it takes start behind. So. Ah, exactly. So, uh, so I think that's the correct thing to do. We, he, he, he wasn't, he wasn't to be to know that uh, he uh, snicker paid the other way would, uh, would, would, uh, would block uh, Austin. But Austin's going to play tenanted, and uh, we, I believe, uh, but a, a lovely balanced rack there for uh, for James. Straight out of the bag is uh, is is looking very nice. So basically, Austin has to play his bingo and hope to draw. He has, he has to draw a bingo where he can, you know, hook, hook the AL basically. He's going to have to draw. Um, he's going to have to play two more bingos. Um, and, uh, yeah. you know, he, he's just too far behind. Uh, you would think. Uh, it's, not, it's not out of the question. Um, you know, as we've seen, uh, James could. Uh, who knows? He could let the nerves get to him, the potential of beating a grandmaster player. But uh, I don't think James is, uh, is is going to be too uh, too stressed out with this. He he he's got scoring potential on his next turn. So uh, Austin's using a bit of time. They've got six and five minutes left each. Six uh, just under seven minutes there for uh, for Austin. So they're they're not under massive time pressure either of them. So. Uh, What can you see for um, for James on the next move, uh, uh, Gutam? No, I mean, if Austin exposes the T, he can play over melt. But otherwise, I mean, he has he has to score off the tenant. I'm guessing. Mm -hmm.
Uh, currently, he can play a mover through, uh, on top of Snicker, which should be helpful for him. But of course, uh, Austin will, will, yeah. will play the ball. He's got the potential to play move at the top uh, above uh, Met and uh, uh, above LIEU, uh, Met and, yeah, uh, o, and OU, and put a put an E on the triple line, which would which wouldn't be uh, disastrous. Uh, at this stage in the game, it sets up a scoring opportunity. Um, but uh, yeah, Aust Austin player uh, using up a fair bit of time here. Yeah? He's currently uh, 159 behind uh, after losing out to Slippard and Snicker. And although he found Anabid, um, He's, uh, he's quite a quite a few points behind. Earlier on, uh, James had missed uh, the opening bingo, and then Austin himself had missed Whitlow's. So uh, they both missed bingos on the first turns. And uh, since then... Um, okay, I have a bad feeling about this. He's taking two towels. Yeah. So uh, this, this, is, uh, this is a bit un-Austin-like. Oh goodness! Oh goodness! Well, <laughs> well, GG. there's no, uh, there's, there's no, uh, no um, excuses there. Uh, yeah. We're surprised that uh, he hasn't played uh, tenanted. It is a word, right? Yeah, it is. It is. Yeah, and uh, that's got to go down as another error. So we're going to see. Um, a scoring play here from uh, uh, from um, from James. Yeah, Austin just provided a lane for James to score. Yeah. This game is. Uh, we believe is not going to be uh, as close and as exciting as the first, uh, although we're going to see a, a somewhat surprising winner with the much lower rated James Burley uh, taking out uh, Austin Shin. But stranger things me, have happened in Scrabble than, uh, me, than, than me, a turnaround. So. Me in, in, this, in this game, you really can't look at ratings too much. Though. I mean, uh, win is a win. It doesn't matter who you who you beat. It's, it's still the same. Like all, all, all opponents are strong. You know, it, it doesn't they're, matter they're, what the rating is. I I I agree with you. But uh, with with Austin going very very well, James is going to feel very uh, buoyed by I mean, yeah, uh, by, by there, yeah, winning. <laughs> and uh, that's going to be that's going to be strong. I'm sure it's not going to affect uh, Austin too much. And, until until perhaps he he looks back at the things that he the mistakes that he made in this game. I'm not sure if he's the sort of player who looks back at things during uh, oh, during oh, tournaments. Oh, what's going on? What's going on? oh my god! Oh, there's he no there's no assessment, right? Oh, he oh, just 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 kind of block block the place with remove. Um, I mean, okay. I don't I don't really agree with that, but no, it, but that's the move of a player who wants to hang on to. Is win and thinks that that's the best way to do it. Um, oh, but I mean, you, you're especially a after, T, after TEN. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. And and you played your two E's, and uh, I don't like that. I would much prefer move at the top, setting up the triple because uh, it's obvious that Austin's got one point tiles, and uh, he, he wouldn't have been he wouldn't have hurt him by setting up move at the top, putting the E on the triple line. And this, uh, well, it, you know, it could. You know what you're drawing. It's not it. <laughs> oh, my goodness. He is drawing very nicely. I mean, if, if Austin wants style points, he can just be unremoved. 
<laughs> unremoved. Yeah, unremoved looks like star points. So um, James has not uh, has not got a uh, a bingo on his rack, uh, even though it looks promising. Through the E, he's got several bingos. Uh, the E of Ranger, but none of them will go down. Um, so um, he plays on. I uh, so sad. Yeah, yeah, that is uh, that is. Um, that's going to score him a few points and perhaps give him a bingo on the next turn. Um, <laughs> here it's Maybe going to be you nine. Draw the queue, right? <laughs> if he goes, oh if he goes we shouldn't laugh, but uh, there he plays. He happens to us all the time too, so yeah, he's not really a bingo. Um, it's, no, he's uh, he's a loser in this game anyway. So he might as well get all of his luck out, uh, bad luck out of the way in uh, in the first game. But um, he has got words Q A T, obviously Q A N A T. Um, but I don't think anything's going to uh, going going to score. Remember, he's got the T now. He's got the T, or he already, yeah, already sure. has had it to hook at the top. But yeah, I think I think he's really holding on his T and D, so he can hook, so he can try and hook the A L. Yeah, yeah, that's right. But then now he, James has the P, which goes there as well. So he yeah, yeah, yeah. Off. I mean, the, the the sensible thing here perhaps is just to play something like Pilar. Is it P I L A R? Is that's the word, isn't it? I mean, yeah, and, just, um, any five-letter word know, will do. And make yeah, any five-letter word will do. But it, that keeps the S as well. And if if he uh, if he does that, um, he's going to be so far ahead that he knows he's yeah. not going to be caught now. Um, he's even got removers, hasn't he? You know, uh, as a as a as a backup as well. But um, <laughs> so Platt would be nice. P L A A I T. Oh dear, what are we seeing here? Oh no, I don't like this. No, I don't. Yeah, that's awful. That's really that's not good. I don't like that, especially when he had Platt. I mean, if he's overlooked P A A L or he doesn't know it, I think it it, uh, it might have been more. more I'm, maybe overlooking the A L spot. Yeah, yeah, clearly, because Platt and saving the RS for removers was uh, was so much better. But uh, here we here we've seen it's not going to make any difference to the to the final score in the game. Uh, what we're going to see here, are we going to see him play QAT through the A of trap there? No, maybe not. He wants to keep that T, doesn't he? Well, he doesn't have a choice. Yeah, he's going to play it. No, he's going to play it. Leave two A's. He's got the D, so could be worse. But uh, yeah, actually, just just playing removal would have been fine because there's the last S. You can just set so, up the uh, S and laugh. Mm. So we've got uh, James has drawn the Z, which is going to uh, obviously give him. Uh, 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 should give him some scoring scoring potential, and uh, yeah, this could be a very very big win for um, for James. Um, he's getting pretty uh, pretty excited about uh, about how many uh, points he's going to going to get here uh, over over Austin. So. Um, D E A N A G E. Does it, is there any bingo there? It doesn't look like it. No, it can be. Okay. Q Z makes perfect sense. He scores, and um, uh, he keeps two eyes. But so what? I, I, I mean, uh, I probably I prefer all Z, but I guess fine. I I think I would have played Z, but um, you know, whatever. So, um, what are we uh, what are we suggesting for uh, for um, Austin on the left there? Uh, well, he can just resign. 
it's not usually an option in Scrabble. He plays Naga, he scores. Uh, fair enough. Um, and uh, that's going to maximise his chance. Perhaps uh, is there an S to come? We're looking at. Uh, uh, see, I didn't. I didn't. Just, I didn't realise the bag was empty. Oh right. Okay. Okay. We're we're down to the nubbins of the game anyway. So uh, so fair enough. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. We are indeed. So he's only got de de left. That's li. And yeah, we're right to the we're right to the end of the game now. So um, a thumping win by uh, by approximately 170 points for um, for James Burley, and yeah. uh, that's going to give him a great feeling. Uh, uh, Having beaten uh, Austin Shin, who's uh, one of the best players in the world, looks like he's uh, maximised his score well with Naga and ID. So uh, good. I think uh, Austin could look back on that and say hey, there were opportunities missed, um, and they shake hands, and uh, that is a one uh, one hundred and. Uh, uh, 62 point win for James Burley and uh, Austin will have to uh, take that one on the chin yeah what can I say guys wow I'm sure Austin saw those words and self confidence as well that probably maybe had something to do with it well, he, he put Whitlow on his rack, or he, did, or, yeah, or he, he did. seemed to put Whitlow on his rack. Uh, he, he couldn't possibly imagine, surely, that Whitlow wouldn't take an S, and there was there was there was one floating. It was his only play, so rather yeah, Whit strange Whitlow there. Whitlow also played by itself as well. Yeah, there was a spot under. So. Oh, did it? Right. Uh, uh, oh, okay, okay. So he, so that was the question. He, he obviously, you know, he wasn't sure of the word, um, or maybe so, maybe yeah. he was imagining the blank something else. I don't know. You know, who who knows. We, we we could find out by uh, by asking him. Uh, uh, that would be good. We can, we can just assume that he wasn't sure. He just he just threw the W O W to get a guarantee being gone next turn, which, which didn't work out. Scrabble is a game of mixed missed opportunities as much as great plays, uh, and obviously everything would have been so so different had uh, had um, Austin found that play earlier on and not uh, not found himself, um, you know. Fishing for several turns, but uh, there we go. That is Scrabble, yeah. and uh, the sure mistakes, we are a lot of mistakes are part of it. Absolutely, absolutely. 